Babe, I've got a new system that's going to reinvent our predictions. Ooh. Color coding. That's right. Fancy. You're going to be blue. Go ahead. And I'm going to be yellow. This is going to be fantastic. Up here, the most electrifying man on YouTube entertainment, hanging out today with the most pretty and adorable babe this side of the Mississippi and the other side, too. It's Maria, babe. What's going on? Nothing. I'm ready to get this underway. All right, what? Well, you ready to get this match underwear? Ding, 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 glue. All right, well, listen, let's not waste time then. Let's tell everybody why we're here. It's time for a little AEW full gear pay per views on this weekend, babe. Yes pretty fired up because they've got a ton of matches and a lot of them have some awesome stipulations. We're going to find maybe new champions. More importantly, we're going to find a winner for this predictions bet because it's me versus you. And we've got a bet on the line that let me tell you is loaded with full gear. See if you can figure it out by the end. But right now, we're going to get to moving with the card. We're going to figure out just who I want to win, just who she thinks is going to win. She's uh, always been a favorite to win the AEW predictions. Babe, you're pretty good at this. Thank only AEW. Only AEW. You tend to lose the WWE ones. Mm -hmm. But AEW, I think she's almost undefeated. So here we go. Babe, let's fire start deep with the buy-in. What do you got? Oh, no, no, no. The buy-in. Don't go straight for the main event. She went for two guys. Babe, pump the brakes. Woo, woo, woo. All right? I know how excited you are. Start with the buy-in. Okay. It's a ladies' match, all right? Nyla Rose and Jamie Hayter versus Thunder Rose and Hikira Shida. So who are you picking? I don't know who I'm picking. I'll just mark it right now, Thunder Rosa. Akira Shida. I'm going to go the opposite way and Nyla Rose and Jamie Hayter. What? Not that I want to, but you know. Keep things interesting? No, because I'm thinking along the lines. The uh, heels are going to win. Okay. That's the buy-in. Let's get right to the main event, babe. Let's fire... Darby Allen versus MJF. Okay. We're getting right to uh, the main event. Darby Allen, MJF, now two of your favorites, babe. Yeah, but I'm going with MJF. I, it, was there any, any fucking question? Now, to keep things interesting, because I really, I don't know who to pick. I, I, could they put MJF over because he's the hugest heel? Is, is Darby Allen going to give MJF his comeuppance? I'm going to pick Darby Allen to keep it real. To keep it interesting, Darby Allen is on the scoreboard for Dew Hop. Babe. What? Why? Why? What do you mean why? Because I'm not picking MJF. You're pissed off. Yeah. Next. Next. Uh, next. Cody Rhodes and Pac versus Malachi Black and Andrade. I don't know how to say the rest of that. El Idolo. El Idolo. Did I say that right? No. See. Well, I now I'm now I made a um, jerk of myself. I'm going Cody Pac. I was kind of going in the opposite direction. Mm. All right, well, I'm marking mine. Cody Pac. With... Tired of Cody winning. CM Punk, Eddie Kingston. Can no. we skip this? No, I don't know. There's no stipulation. This is just a grudge match with years in the making here. CM Punk, Eddie Kingston. I got to be honest. I'm picking Eddie Kingston. Who are you picking, babe? There's no stipulation, nothing. N nothing. It's just a grudge. Oh, I feel like it's gonna end in a draw. Yes. I was gonna say draw. A draw. Are you are you picking a draw? No, but oh, you you're gonna pick CM Punk, best in the world. You, you know you want to. Yeah. Oh, there she did it! Damn it, babe. Here we go. Fire deep. This is the one I'm really interested in because Dan Lambert is on the team for American Top Team with Scorpio Sky, Ethan Page. All right. Those guys taking on the inner circle. Jericho leading his horsemen or henchmen, whatever you want to call it, down to the ring for this huge five on five, babe. It's a Minneapolis story fight. What do you got? Inner circle or top team? Inner circle. Go ahead, Mark it. I'm picking American Top Team. Why? Because I feel like Dan Lambert's gonna get his ass beat. It's gonna be hysterical, but cheat to win. 
I think that they're going to do it. They're going to pull an MJF. They are. American top team for the win on that. It breaks my heart because I really want I want Jericho to really be Dan Lambert's ass. It's going to be great. Here we go. Moving on. We've got the super click, Young Bucks, Adam Cole, babe, versus the Jurassic Express, Jungle Boy, uh, and uh, Luchasaurus, Christian Cage, all on a triple. This one here falls count anywhere. I'm going to go with Jurassic Express and Christian Cage. Well, mark it down then. Because I'm telling you right now, the super click, nobody, no. nobody puts themselves over better. <laughs> Okay, then the Young Bucks. Something's gonna happen. What gonna, what's gonna happen? The Young Bucks are gonna win. That's what's gonna happen. Eliminator Tournament Finals. Miro, Brian Danielson, American Dragon. This one's a tough pick. Who's gonna Who's gonna face the winner of Kenny Omega and Hangman Adam Page, which we have yet to get to? Brian Danielson. You think? Because I was actually thinking Miro. You haven't picked anything the same as me. Which is fantastic. This is going to be a banger of a um, predictions battle back and forth. Unless you pick them all right and I get nothing right. We'll see. Tag team gold on the line. Lucha Bros defend against FTR. Here we go. Um, no stipulation on this. Just a tag title match. This is a tough one. It's not for me, babe. Lucha Bros retain. Although, FTR is great at fucking people over. Lucha Bros. I'm gonna have to think about this one. All right, well, you wanna come back to it? Yeah. Do you, would you already know the answer to the women's championship match? Britt Baker, champion, defends it against Ty Conti? Yeah, Who you pick? Britt Baker. Yeah. I, I, I have, well, there it is, babe. We picked the same one, Britt Baker. How do you feel about that? I feel great. She's gonna hold on to it until the TBS title. I'm not saying she's going to win it. I'm saying until that time period commences while all the women are in the tournament. Oh, uh, I see what you're saying. Well, then let's roll it back to the tag titles. Come on, babe. Fire in on it. Well, FTR already has the AAA titles. They do. Remember our bet? What happens when you lose? I can't wait to tell you guys. I'm going to go with FTR. <gasps> she did it. It's highlighted in blue, FTR. All right, last match, our main event of the evening. Full gear leads to this. Kenny Omega, our AEW champion, defends against number one contender, the returning and winner of the Casino Royal Ladder match when he was the um, wild card entrant, Hangman Adam Page. Who do I have? That was the captain Where the fuck highlight. Did it go? I don't know, but I got so excited. I popped my top about this. I did too. Hangman Adam Page. I can't wait to watch Hangman Adam Page lose. What? Yep, Kenny Omega, you wait. Everybody's gonna think Hangman Page is gonna win. Kenny Omega wins. They all think Hangman Page is gonna win this. Kenny Omega and still AEW. Kenny Champion. Omega and Brian Danielson was a great match. Let me tell you right now. So part two wouldn't be bad. Would not be bad at all. But I've got this theory in the back of my head that Kenny Omega will have that title longer than Roman Reigns has the universal title. <laughs> Is that what you're basing this on? They just want Roman Reigns to pass Punk. What if Brian Danielson holds the title longer? I don't know. But it's not going to be Hangman As Adam Page. It's not going to be Page. Oh, I really it is. Love with it. I can't wait to watch Saturday night. All right. Now that I don't have a lid for my highlighter. Um, Careful. It's my table. There it is. If you guys want to take a screenshot, we've got it down. That way you know. Now, AEW full gear. Loser of this predictions bet is getting it deep because um if you're not if you're not aware the adorable duo here will be in attendance at the barclay center for wwe survivor series okay so the loser of the aew full gear will be dressed in the choice of the winner's gear 
at Survivor Series, okay? So what's gonna happen here is she's gonna, if she wins the full gear predictions, she's gonna choose what wrestling t-shirt I have to wear at Survivor Series. Are so, you allowed to go in there with an AEW shirt? I don't know. We're going to find out. But uh, so, again, if I win, I get to select what T-shirt, wrestling T-shirt, she's going to be wearing through the doors of WWE Survivor Series. Guys, there's a possible chance here that I could show up to Survivor Series wearing a fucking Sting T-shirt. Yeah. Because she wants to do that to me. Although, okay. I will do that to you. All right. Well. Maybe. We'll see. Either way. Who else don't you like? Maybe I'll make the t-shirt for you when I win. Maybe it'll be I'll a, make the t-shirt ma for you. It'll be a wrestling t-shirt. I didn't mean I bought it from Pro Wrestling Tees or I bought it from the WWE shop. Either way, you will be full geared at Survivor Series because that's what the loser's going to be doing. Excuse for my dirtiness. What do you think of the bet? What do you think of the predictions? What do you think of AEW full gear? I know we're excited. We are locked and loaded. Can't wait for this Saturday night. Like the video. Leave all of your comments down below. Let us know what you think of what's going down. If you haven't done it already, subscribe for some more blue and yellow highlighters. Yeah. <laughs>